Welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you are new here, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell icon to stay updated with our latest content. Today, we're diving deep into the world of ethical hacking and cybersecurity. We're talking about the heavy hitters, the champions of penetration testing operating systems, Kali Linux and BlackArch. These aren't your everyday operating systems, they're purpose-built, loaded with tools designed to probe, scan, and ethically exploit vulnerabilities. But which one comes out on top? Which one gives you the absolute best toolkit for ethical hacking and security assessments? That's exactly what we're here to find out. Let's dive in. First up, let's talk Kali Linux. Developed by Offensive Security, Kali Linux has a rich history, evolving from the legendary Backtrack Linux distribution. We're talking years of refinement, updates, and a relentless focus on providing security professionals with the most comprehensive toolkit. Kali isn't just some random collection of hacking tools. It's a carefully curated operating system built on Debian Linux, known for its stability and robust package management. This means Kali inherits a solid foundation while offering a user-friendly experience, even if you're new to the Linux world. It comes preloaded with a massive arsenal of over 600 tools, each meticulously categorized for different attack vectors and security assessments. Whether you're into network scanning, web application testing, or wireless analysis, Kali has you covered. And because Kali is open source, it benefits from a massive global community of security researchers and enthusiasts. You're never alone when using Kali. Now, let's shift our focus to the contender, BlackArch Linux. If Kali Linux is a well-equipped armory, BlackArch is a sprawling arsenal. This independent distribution, also built upon the solid foundation of Arch Linux, takes the more is better approach to heart. BlackArch boasts an absolutely massive repository of over 2,700 security tools, dwarfing even Kali's impressive collection. It's a veritable buffet for security researchers, pen testers, and anyone who wants access to the most comprehensive set of tools available. BlackArch's strength lies in its sheer breadth of tools. You'll find everything from the classics like Nmap and Metasploit to obscure utilities you never even knew existed. However, this vastness comes with a trade-off. BlackArch can be overwhelming for beginners, and managing such a massive repository requires a deeper understanding of Linux. Let's get down to brass tacks. We're talking tools, the heart and soul of any good hacking OS. And Kali Linux doesn't disappoint. It's packing some serious heat with a lineup of tools that would make any security pro drool. First up, we've got Nmap, the network mapper extraordinaire. This tool is like the Swiss army knife of network scanning, allowing you to discover hosts, identify open ports, and even fingerprint operating systems. Then there's Metasploit Framework, the undisputed king of exploit development and delivery. No security toolkit would be complete without Wireshark, the network protocol analyzer that lets you dissect network traffic with surgical precision. But Kali doesn't stop there. You've got Burp Suite for web application testing, John the Ripper for password cracking, and Aircrack NG for wireless network auditing. And the best part? Kali's developers understand that usability matters. Now, let's talk about BlackArch's approach to tools. BlackArch is a vast, sprawling library with over 2,700 tools. It's a treasure trove for experienced hackers, offering niche tools for specialized tasks. However, it can be overwhelming for beginners. BlackArch's strength lies in its flexibility and customization. All right, let's talk user experience. Because let's be real. Nobody wants to wrestle with a clunky interface when they're trying to hack the Gibson. Kali Linux shines in this department. It's built on the user-friendly GNOME desktop environment, which means you get a clean, intuitive interface that's easy to navigate, even if you're new to Linux. Everything is logically organized, and finding the right tool is a breeze. Kali also offers multiple desktop environments to choose from, so you can customize the look and feel to your liking. BlackArch, on the other hand, takes a more bare-bones approach. It's all about giving you the raw power and flexibility of Arch Linux with minimal bloat. 
This means you'll need to be comfortable with the command line and package managers, like Pac-Man. Black Arch's minimalist approach might seem daunting at first, but it offers unparalleled flexibility. You get to choose exactly what you want to install and configure your system to your exact specifications. Let's face it, even the most seasoned hackers need a helping hand sometimes, and that's where a strong community can make all the difference. Kali Linux benefits from a massive and active community of security professionals, enthusiasts, and hobbyists from around the world. This translates to a wealth of resources, tutorials, and support forums where you can find answers to your questions and connect with like-minded individuals. Offensive Security, the company behind Kali, also maintains extensive official documentation, including detailed user manuals, how-to guides, and a comprehensive knowledge base. Whether you prefer digging through documentation or asking questions in a forum, Kali has you covered. This sense of community is a major advantage of using Kali Linux. Black Arch's community might be smaller than Kali's, but it's no less passionate. It's a tight-knit group of experienced hackers, security researchers, and Linux enthusiasts who are drawn to Black Arch's vast toolkit and customizable nature. The primary hub for all things Black Arch is their official forum. It's a treasure trove of information, with dedicated sections for tool discussions, installation help, and general Black Arch chatter. You'll find experienced users sharing their knowledge, troubleshooting problems, and discussing the latest security trends. One thing you'll notice about the Black Arch community is its focus on self-sufficiency. It's a community that encourages users to dive into the documentation, experiment with different tools, and find solutions on their own. Black Arch's community might not be as large or as visible as some others, but it's a valuable resource for anyone looking to master this powerful penetration testing distribution. Let's talk about getting these operating systems up and running. Both Kali Linux and Black Arch offer various installation options. Kali Linux makes it easy to get started. They provide pre-built ISO images for various architectures. Download the image, flash it to a USB drive, and boot. Black Arch offers a more hands-on approach. Install Arch Linux, then add the Black Arch repository. The Black Arch installation guide is straightforward. Build your custom hacking environment from the ground up. Kali Linux is generally more forgiving with system requirements. Kali Linux stands out with unique features like NetHunter for mobile penetration testing and Docker integration for containerized environments. Specialized builds like Forensics Mode ensure evidence integrity. Combined with a user-friendly interface and community support, Kali Linux is ideal for professionals and aspiring ethical hackers. Black Arch might be known for its vast toolkit, but it also has a few tricks up its sleeve that set it apart from the crowd. These hidden gems might not be as widely publicized as Kali's features, but they're no less impressive. One of Black Arch's standout features is its support for multiple window managers. While it defaults to the lightweight and customizable DWM, you can easily install and configure other popular window managers like i3, Awesome, or even GNOME if you prefer a more traditional desktop environment. Another hidden gem is Black Arch's extensive collection of scripts and utilities for automating common tasks. These scripts can save you countless hours by automating everything from system updates to vulnerability scanning. Black Arch also shines in its support for a wide range of hardware, including older systems. These unique features, combined with its vast toolkit and dedicated community, make Black Arch a formidable choice for experienced hackers and security professionals who demand the ultimate in flexibility and customization. So there you have it, folks. We've explored the origins, the tools, the user experience, and the unique strengths of both Kali Linux and Black Arch. We've dived deep into the world of penetration testing and seen how these operating systems empower security professionals and enthusiasts alike. But the ultimate question remains, which one has the best toolkit? Well, the truth is, there's no one-size-fits-all answer. It depends on your individual needs, your skill level, and your comfort zone. 
Kali Linux shines with its user-friendly interface, curated toolkit, and massive community support. BlackArch, on the other hand, offers unparalleled flexibility, a vast and constantly evolving repository of tools, and a dedicated community of experienced hackers. So, which OS do you think has the best toolkit? Let us know in the comments below. And while you're at it, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more tech comparisons and reviews. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.